This is the, this is a Scott built home. This is a Scott built. The name of this home is the Georgian. This is the Georgian, really pretty. Can't wait to see what it looks like. So let's go on in. this is the door that we just came in right there that's the door that we just came in you got your foyer area here really nice you can put a bench there you can put a feature wall there really nice decor if you're a shiplap type of person or if you want to just paint that wall another color you could have a nice entry table bench, seating, whatever you like. It's a nice space for that. So when you come in to the door and from this foyer area, it you look into the living room on the right. We have the master on the left. We'll come back and look at that. Here's the living room. You've got a ceiling fan in the living room, carpet, really nice. You got a gas fireplace. Now that's shiplap. Maybe you want something different. Um, it doesn't have to be shiplap. It could be just a colored, excuse me, putting my stuff down. It could be a colored wall. It could be whatever you like um, when you order the home. So keep that in mind. Don't let the shiplap deter you. I know there are some people that don't care for the shiplap. And you know what? I just realized that I toured this home before, but when I toured it before, this is a different home. So they must have sold the first one. It didn't have that wall. I'll link the other tour here so you can compare the two houses. Um, and also the foyer was a little different, but I have toured this home before. Very nice. So from the living room, you look into the kitchen and dining room area. This is your dining room. You have uh, double doors. Slide, the sliding glass doors there. Really nice. Sorry, it is so hot, you guys. You have sliding glass doors there, which is always a nice touch. And then over here is your kitchen. Beautiful, you got space for two or three bar stools. You've got black appliances in here, built-in microwave, uh, black sink which i think looks really nice with the black um appliances and you've got lots of cabinet space uppers and lowers as as well as four drawers uh in your counters you also have cabinet space under the sink as well as your dishwasher in the island there's your refrigerator, and then you even have space on this side of the refrigerator for, I don't know, an appliance or a beverage station, what have you. There's can lights in the ceiling. And then here's your pantry. Now, this pantry has the farm doors. Uh, even though it's not up, the farm door go there, but of course, it doesn't have to be a farm door. You can do a different door or you can choose to not have that up there and leave it open. It's really up to you. Really nice. Really, really nice. Now over here, you have your utility room off the dining room. Your washer and dryer will go there. You got a transom window in here. And then on this side of the utility room, you have a desk. How nice. How nice is that? So you can pay your bills, have your personal computer, fold laundry, do whatever you like over in this space extra storage this could be your beverage station whatever you like really really nice i have a feeling that that 
Let's see what this is. Oh, how lovely. It goes into, so you can go into one of the, the guest bathroom from the utility room, but we'll walk around and we'll see that from another side. So very nice, that's your utility room. All right, back into the living room. To the left here, you have the guest bedrooms. Here's the bathroom that we just saw. You have a sink here. You have kind of a medicine cabinet type area there. You've got a transom window in this bathroom. And you got your tub shower combo. And again, this door goes to the laundry room. Don't know how, it depends on how old my kids are. I don't know if I'd like them being off the laundry room like that, but this space would be perfect for someone. I don't have kids, so that wouldn't be a concern for me. If I did, I don't know how, how I would like that. Guest bedroom number one, you guys. Can't really get a good picture because all the doors and drawers are in here, but I'm gonna walk around and let you get a give you an idea of how big this space is. And the closet looks pretty big, so let's go take a look here. All right, so you got a big walk-in closet. Hope you can see that. Big walk-in closet there. And I'll give you one more look at the room. I hope this video looks good, you guys. I'm telling you, I, I am, uh, I've got so much new stuff that I need to learn how to use. This is a new wide angle lens and I, I'm, I'm pretty sure I don't have it on the right setting. So please excuse the different, me changing the lighting, etc. I'm learning. Here's your other walk-in closet and we'll get a, I'm standing in the closet to give you an idea of just how big this room is. So very good. And I'll, if for if any of the houses that I'm touring today, you guys know that if there are decor picks online, I'll put those in there too to give you an idea, especially if the home isn't staged, okay? So, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Now this master is on the other side of the front door. We came in to this foyer and to the right is your living room and your dining room and kitchen. But to your left of the front door is the master. So let's go check out the master. This house is, hasn't been completely put together but so you still see some things not yet together but I wanted to give you a good idea of what the master looks like how big it is okay awesome you've got the master closet here got shelving on this side so that's the master closet and then you've got the master bed bathroom here you've got double sinks on this side three beautiful mirrors actually one big mirror but I, the the way it's designed it looks like it's three I like that you've got two sinks space for a makeup counter out two outlets there one for each sink Lots of drawers and cabinet space. You've got the huge shower with the rain shower shower head. It's a walk-in shower. You've got your master soaker tub here. You've got a big mirror on one side and a frosted window on the other side. Let's see if I can give you an idea. That window is frosted. It's frosted. All right, so there's the tub and the mirror. And then your toilet is over here. 
on the other side of the shower and that window actually opens. Very nice. All right, so let's go get you some pricing. I have it in my pocket here somewhere. Oh no, I don't. I set it up there with my drink. So let's go get the price. Again, this is the Georgian. I wanna say the home that I toured like this may have had another name, but I will find out. This is a Scott built home. It's a three bedroom, two bath. It's a tw it's 28 by 56. The price is $84,900. $84,900. And all of the dealer information will be in the description box. Thank you guys so much for watching. You want now Feels like you're looking for something better